All right, this might be a little cold. So diagnostic ultrasound is a tool that we've used in medicine for decades. When most people think about diagnostic ultrasound, they think about that when they go to see their obstetrician, when they're going through a pregnancy. But in the right hands, this is a tool that can be used by several different medical providers, and we use it here in sports medicine all the time. How it works is we have a transducer that sends sound waves into the patient's body, and then it reflects back to the transducer, and with that signal, we get a picture on a computer screen. And with that picture, we can see all different types of tissues. We can see bones, we can see soft tissues like muscles, tendons, ligaments, and we can even see into joints. With that picture, then we can take what we know looks like normal and abnormal and make decisions. We can see if that soft tissue has been damaged. Is there any stretching? Is there any tearing? Is there any swelling? We can even see if there's any extra blood flow in the area, which could indicate an injury. There are several different benefits to musculoskeletal ultrasound. Number one, it's safe. There is no risk to the patient. This uses sound waves. There's no radiation exposure. So it's a, it's a great tool that we use in children. It's convenient. We can use it in point of care. Is when you guys come in to see us in the clinic, um, in addition to the normal visit, where we do our history and physical exam, we can then use the ultrasound to help us. It's portable, so we can take it with us. So wherever we go, it can go with us. So that's not only just in the clinic, but we'll take it to a sideline, we'll take it to an athletic training room. We can really use that tool anywhere that we go. It's dynamic, meaning that most of the images that we get in radiology, they're static, they don't move. But with ultrasound, we're able to see things in motion in real time. So we can see the patient move a muscle or a tendon, or we can move that joint for them and see if a ligament is stretched. So that is a great tool for us in sports medicine. It's also a good tool for the patient. So as we're learning about the patient when we look in these images, we can also educate the patient in real time. They can see what we're seeing as we're doing the test. And that will help them better understand what's going on with their injury.